All right, Selector said, yo, what... Oh, fuck's sake. Back. Yo, what's your opinion on leasehold versus freehold? You can't get freehold on flat. Apparently, it is like 1% of flats that you can get freehold on. But yeah, for the most part, they're leasehold. Personally, obviously, I'd rather have a leasehold, um, a freehold property, like obviously a house, rather than a leasehold um, flat. Because obviously, you don't own the building. So... The thing is, yeah, like let's say yeah, you own a flat, yeah, because it's leasehold and that, allegedly you need to get permission from the leasehold, uh, the freeholder who owns the building, yeah. So let's say, for example, yeah, you you buy a flat in a block of flats, yeah, you buy one unit, uh, flat fifteen out of, uh, I don't know, twenty flats, yeah, you own flat fifteen. If you want to do any alterations and that, allegedly you have to notify the freeholder, which might be Harringay Council or Hackney Council or whoever, might be a private freeholder who owns the whole lease, who owns the building. But it's bullshit like that. When you have a, a leasehold flat, you have to pay service charge and ground rent and that. And obviously, I'm doing that right now. If I could avoid it, I would, but it's not, it's not the worst thing. It's not, it's not the worst thing, but I'd still rather have a freehold property. 